Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to a flip through video. This one being, of course, for my coloring book, Deco Dolls. Those of you who have been coloring in my coloring books for a while are going to recognize a repetition of themes in here. We've got the retro fabulous fashion, we have the graphical elements, we have a little bit of, just a little touch of femme fatale, and we've got a healthy dose of art deco inspired elements. That is what Deco Dolls is all about. I put my spooklets into an Art Deco blender in 1984 through, let's say, well, let's say mm, 1982 through 1986. I think that's kind of where we fall in terms of aesthetics in this book. We've got lots of funky hair, lots of funky makeup, and tons and tons of cool graphic art deco inspired elements. If you have been with me for a while, you may recall retro deco. Retro deco is in many respects kind of a, she's the bigger sister to deco dolls because she did come first. Now retro deco is a little bit different. That one is more of a 1980s new wave synth wave flavored gem so that one it's similar but different this one we put away the synth wave elements the kind of borderline sci-fi just a little slight tinge a sprinkle of sci-fi 80s futurism we got rid of that and what i did is i emphasized the fashion and the art deco inspiration we've got lots of bobbed haircuts funky hats with a couple little skulls thrown in because you know these are my spooklets after all we have to have the skulls or else they wouldn't be my girls now of course these spooky gothic elements do not permeate this book but we do have the eyeliner we have the pointiness we have the femme fatale look mm, meow we love it we love to see it this book is of course inspired by my favorite period of fashion and music being the 70s and the 80s. There's lots of that in here. More 80s leaning than 70s to be fair, but we do have that overhang, that little overlap of the late 70s and then moving properly into the 80s. If I had my way, if I could create my own fashion and assemble and create my own jewelry, this is probably what I would look like on a daily basis. I mean, I can't grow a wonky neck, but all of the glamour, the ostentatious aesthetics, all of it. I would love to throw a party and see every single one of these gals in attendance, whether they are dancing and participating or not, or whether they simply show up to be seen. We love it. We love it all. The book is available as both a bound version and a printable version. The bound versions are available on Amazon, printable versions exclusively in my Etsy shop, and periodically I do offer signed copies, physical copies, signed bound versions in my Etsy shop. I don't always have them available, but periodically they do spring into my shop. All of that being said, thank you so much for joining me on my coloring journey. For those of you who loved Retro Deco, you are going to love Deco dolls. If you are interested in fashion with a retro flavor, with a little bit of spooky spice tossed in for just a little bit more flavor, just a little bit more, and a healthy, healthy dose of Art Deco, I recommend grabbing your copy of Deco dolls. Don't forget to hashtag your pages if you are so inclined to share on social media. I would love to see them and feature them on my stories. Thank you once again for being here. I hope that you enjoy this book. Let me know what you think and I will see you in the next one.